Hello everyone, this is MJPW Gaming and welcome back. Today we got the Rave in the Redwoods trailer. It looks like it's going to be a whole lot of fun. If you have not seen it yet, I'll throw a card up now and I also have it in the description. So what I did, I've broken down the whole trailer and put it in sort of different sections. In the different sections is going to be the map, the characters, and the weapons. And out of all three of those categories, there is a lot to cover, so let's get right into it. So, Rave in the Redwoods woods is a abandoned summer camp called Bear Lake. If you've ever been to any sort of campground that had like cabins and a big lake then this is going to be like exactly the same thing. And again if you've seen any of the like Friday the 13th films even if you have not been to an actual campsite this is that. And the map features different kinds of equipment that you can use such as a, a zip line similar to the one sort of in Call of the Dead. And then there's also piranhas in the lake and there's also the Flogger, that's just about the same thing from Shinonuma. And then finally, we also have a DJ station for a giant rave trap, which attracts a bunch of zombies in front so they can all dance and they explode and kill them all. And then we have the Delirium Vision, which it looks like our characters have just taking some really trippy drugs. And then finally, we have the Pack Bunch Room, and it is still the projection room like we had in Zombies in Spaceland. I assume that that jar that we put that key in from the easter egg is going to relate to this map in a way that uh, maybe we'll see after the whole DLC season. Next up we have our characters. Our characters are back and they are completely redesigned but they do have their same names. We have Sally, Poindexter, AJ, and Andre. Then next up we have several different kinds of bosses and first up we have a Bigfoot type of monster. And then we have the Slasher. The Slasher carries a concrete saw and he looks absolutely terrifying and I love how he looks. There's even one scene in the trailer where he's actually grinding the saw against his metal mask. That, if I saw that in real life, I would have been running. And also a little Easter egg for you little Easter egg theorists. The Slasher also has a Jason Voorhees tattoo on his arm. So those of you that wanted to see Jason in this map, there you go. Then next up, I'm not quite too sure how happy I am with this one. Uh, I guess we'll see how the map comes out, but the Brute returns, but with a completely new look. He looks very, very similar to the Slasher's design. However, he does obviously do a new effect where he hops great distances. And then finally, I don't think he's a boss, but he is definitely something that looks like an AI, and I'm sure he's going to be a playable character at the end of the Easter egg. It's somehow like a cheat code, you know, how like we had the Hoff. We have Kevin Smith. For those of you that do not know him, he was Silent Boss and Jay and Silent Bob. He was also, I think, the lead of Comic Book Men. That's the main things that I know him from. He's in a lot of different sort of things. But uh, that's pretty interesting. I'm glad to see him in the map. That's, that's pretty awesome. And then next up, we have the weapons. The map features new melee weapons, a nailed baseball bat, a machete, a golf club, throwing knives, a double-sided axe, and it seems like the axe from Spaceland is going to be coming back into this one as well. And we also have a new crossbow type wonder weapon that sends off like a lightning and explosions. It's pretty cool. And lastly, I don't think this might be possible. It might just be a fact for the trailer, but it might be possible to actually obtain the slasher saw. I guess we will have to see in one week's time. This is Raven the Redwoods and I cannot express how excited I am about this map. I have been counting down the days if not the hours. So that is going to do it for this video. If you have enjoyed please leave a like and possibly subscribe. going to have a lot of Raven the Redwoods footage coming very very soon. So thank you so much for watching and goodbye.